Hello everybody, back here. So, last time I tried to record a game, as you can see here, my team is... Crap, stuck. Eight and five, well, I was playing against the Texans and I was about at half time and then the game locked up, so it kicked me out, so I came back in, I tried to continue where I was at and then it locked up again. And then what happened was it took me back to the original Panthers versus Seahawks situation and I thought the thing was corrupted but it wasn't but so I ended up simulating the game because I thought something was wrong with it my team lost so now I'm thinking I might have been the thing that caused my game to freeze might have been the community file so I'm not gonna do that anymore I'm only gonna maybe download one where I feel it's pr really good good gameplay where the everything's balanced out so this I'm gonna be trying this one uh, and if and uh, NFL on CBS so this is every all the sliders here so as long as it's not BS but it's not too easy I'm gonna keep it, but I'm not gonna be downloading like custom playbooks and stuff well I might download maybe one or two but I'm not gonna download a whole bunch because it seems like it screws up my game so I'm not gonna do that so let's get into this oh great the Ravens my god they gave me a freaking heart attack yesterday give my New England Patriots a freaking run for their money That's, yeah, Carolina got kind of got stomped. I like Carolina. They got beat by Seattle pretty handedly. So, yeah, I, I have I have this feeling Seattle's going to end up beating my team in the Super Bowl. Seattle looks a little too good right now. Hello, everybody. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. In today's matchup, we've got a pair of running backs. Now, if all I know, Colts will end up beating New England next week, so I'm not getting too confident right now like everyone in Seattle is. And everyone in Seattle gets way too confident. I'm, I'm not going to get that like that. I know my New England Patriots get kicked out a, a lot in the playoffs, so I'm not going to get confident at all. Even though they played a good game against Baltimore yesterday, but... That secondary was very suspect. All right, here we go. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, man. God dang it. Bortles going to be the one leading this offense today. Last week, he accounted for over 200 yards passing. First and 10. Oh, man. Tackle. Here's our look at the Jaguars offensive line. All right. They've done a great job of converting on third down. Something here. Right out of the shotgun. Trying to work that left. Nice. Side. He's tackled right at the 43. When you see zone defenses, throw it into the open spaces. That's what the quarterback did that time. Good job by the receiver running in there and making the catch. First down at the 43. Has his target. Ah! Take that slow down. When the offense crosses the 50-yard line on defense, you have to be careful now because... It gives the offense a little confidence. But and what see. they're going to do here, they're looking for the big play down the field for that quick score. So on defense, yeah, here we go. Play safe. Oh, yes. I actually tried to stiff arm there, but I accidentally the pressed B. Oops. The 20, it worked, though. The so-called red zone or green zone by some teams. But the defense, you can be a little more aggressive now. 
because you don't have to worry about the length of the field. It is short. So take card sides in. And attack this offense a little more. Give Peppers the credit for that tackle. And now here's the Ravens line up on defense. They've given up a lot of passing yards this season, so they'll need to try and keep the offense in check today. Portals got it in the gun. Catch oh. Made. He stacked up at that right point. in there. Yeah. If I'm on the defense and the right, offense is this close there. to scoring, I'll tell you what Come I'm on. doing. Hey, let's I see. am sending everybody. I am going to gamble. Runs right in. For the touchdown. Yeah. The Jaguars trying to bounce back after last week's tough loss, and they're doing just that so far. Winning in a close one. Yeah, you hate that feeling after losing a close game, so you got to find a way to make that play so you don't have that same feeling you had after last week's game. Booming kick. Yeah, this will be better touch out back. To the 20 as he thinks better of running it out of the end zone this time. Coming on to the field, the former league MVP and Super Bowl winning quarterback, Aaron Rodgers. Uh -oh. There's no throw Aaron Rodgers, and Anquan Bolden, Zach Ertz, Trey Lance Moore, and is that A.J. Green, maybe? When he wants to, but those deep uh, get out of the way. Oh. going to be a tough defense. game. On the stop. Matt Forte. I Holy think we crap. heard this expression about 7,000 times. It's a passing league, so we all know that. So you got to be able to some throw kind the ball and pick up some here. first Holy downs. Crap. They bring in the extra tight end. First down at the third uh, line. No. Here's the handle. Uh, Matt Forte. God dang it. Imposing their will early on the defense with a solid effort on the ground. Yeah, we talk so much, don't we, about the passing game in the NFL. But it's still about who can out hit the other one. And right now, the uh, offense, they uh, are winning that battle. Nice yeah. Ball. Let's take a look at the Ravens offense, starting with the offensive line. This is an offense that has one of the most dangerous passing attacks in the NFL this season. The Ravens take it from oh, the 43. Come on, get him. Hayes yes. On the handoff. Here's the Jaguars defense. When a quarterback sees this team on his schedule, he can't sleep for weeks. He knows they're the best in the league when it comes to getting the quarterback down. Third and come four. On. Oh, come on. What the freak? Oh my God. Are you kidding me? He got that? Oh, wow. You just can't expect your defensive backs to cover that long. Oh it's my God! I can't believe he got that away. Holy crap! All day long, and sooner or later, these great wide receivers are going to get open. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. My, uh, oh man! Gets the move to the right. Picks up eight here. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to, and also. It opens up so many other things for your offense. Second down. My, go. uh, no! Dang it! You jerk offs. Uh. Uh, score ties the game up. Now on the defensive side, you've got to come out there and take advantage of this, this feeling you got going now and get the football back for your offense. The Ravens were very effective on that scoring yeah. drive, especially Dang via it. the pass. Over 50 passing yards on that scoring drive. Hester will run this one out. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. It's first down as they head to the line. Cooks is a receiver in the slot. They'll hike it to him out of the shotgun. What the freak? He got stuck on time. the freaking defender. Come on, the man. Did everything right that situation. They oh, he got stuck. Smart. They read the quarterback's eyes, but they dropped the pass. They've come out in a dime package. Second down and ten. Oh my God. Jim, you look at drop passes in the NFL. It's almost always for the same reason. They take their eyes off the football, the receivers. 
just before it gets there. And when you do that, that little bit of lack of concentration will cause you to drop the pass. Freaking drop it, man. Come on. Third and ten. Ah! Dang it! How the freak do they get all these players? Oh my god, Clay Matthews too? Nobody's there to block him. There's nothing you can do as a quarterback, but try to protect yourself because you're going down. First down, offense readying for the snap. Rodgers will be under center. Matt Forte. Come on. Ah, get him. Forte tackled down. Second down. The Ravens come to the line with a bunch set. What the heck? Come on. Third down play coming up, and last week that was not an issue as they converted Come on. Time, time again. Aaron Rodgers gonna take it from the shotgun. Oh my god! I hate this bull crap. Possession can be an overrated stat in games many times. But one thing you want to do, throw and catch it just like this to pick up those first downs and keep it going. First down following the long play. And Rodgers will hand it off. Hightower's there to make the tackle. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. And it'll be second down and six after the running play on first down. Gets it again, taking it up the middle. Butler's there to make the tackle. The defense looking for one more stop here on third down after that run. Rodgers will have it in the pistol. Come on. Oh my God. Took him forever. We got to give that defense in front a lot of credit, man. They are pushing. They're getting after it. They know it's probably going to be a pass on third down, and they get back to the quarterback and take him down. The Dang. kick is through for three. You always want to be rewarded for a nice drive in a football game, even when it's a field goal, because you've made a lot of good plays. You've executed them. You got yourself in position to get some points. And that field goal just reinforces everything. Gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. First down here. Hand off. Ah. All over him. Behind the line of scrimmage. And a loss of one. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. The Jaguars bring in an extra tight end for this play. Throws the pass, and that's a gain of nine. The Jaguars do a good job that time on second down. They don't force the football down the field. They throw it short. They pick up some solid yards to make it a good situation for them. Third and short. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Secures it with two hands. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Got to give the defense credit. Oh, no. short, the pass is completed, and they come up there and just smack the receiver, ah, taking him down before he can get the first down. Left, 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 offense left, lines left, up left, here. Left. The Jaguars take it from the 33. Come on! Oh, come on! He wasn't even. He didn't even touch the ground. Bull crap! Good job the defense that time. Come on, they man. Ready for everything. Very aggressive, fast. Uh, this could change the game around. Moore's in the slot. First and ten. What? Bull crap. Bull freaking crap, man. Yeah, that's bull right there.
Cortez in the backfield. Single back set. Hand off May. Oh my God. Not able to get away from Chancellor. The Ravens offensive line will be whooping it up tomorrow when they Oh my god. god. What the freaking heck? Excellent planning and awesome execution. Now first and ten. Gets the handle here. Chancellor's in on the tackle. Safeties now in the NFL have to cover like a corner, and they got to tackle like a linebacker. And that time the safety came up, and he tackled like a linebacker and stopped that outside run. The defense comes out in the nickel. Second down and 11. They want to keep feeding him the football. Now third and 10 following the run. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. Matt Forte lined up in the backfield. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Oh, come on. You couldn't stop him? Hard to throw the football down the field. Once you get the red zone that time, the quarterback, well, he knows that. And he looks down there. Nobody open deep. Throws it short. And they get a nice solid pickup on that play. Call. And he's in. Ah, oh, great. More unstoppable AI nonsense, of course. They just say, you can't stop us. And they lined up and just shoved it down the defense's throat. Nice run there on first and goal for the touchdown. The Ravens about to kick the football away. And... That'll bring their defense back out. Of course, that defensive stand, turning the ball over on downs, set up the offense for the scoring drive. And he runs it out to about the 27 before he's taken down. They face first down. Hooks lined up in the slot. The Jaguars all bunched up here as they get set at the line. They'll go ground. Oh, come on. You stay on your block, man. Oh, my God. When you give him room to run, but there is no room for the What a job by the defense. They bottle him up for a short game. Lacey lines up in the backfield. Second and nine. Clay Matthews makes the tackle. Well, that's a nice completion by the offense. And what it does, it just puts them in a more manageable situation so they can pick up that third down. Third down now. Go, go, go! Go, go, go! Go, go, go! The Jaguars snap it at the 36. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. Good job by the offensive line there on third and short. Even though the defense knew it was probably going to be a run, still able to get in there and barely get that first down. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. Reaches out and grabs it. Ward's in on the tackle. Oh, my God. T.J. Ward, too. Freaking heck. Open the deep, so he throws it short. And it puts him in great position for a second down play call. Go, go, go. Takes off with it. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. Oh, the coach is going, hey, nice job, son. Nice job. Anytime the quarterback takes off on a pass play and picks up a first down, it makes the coaches feel really good. Go, go, go. Lacey lines up in the back. Lacey takes the hit and is brought down. My God, this is the pathetic. The attack has been stopped, and that's a big reason why they are behind. They will have to turn around the ground attack, Phil, to get back into this game. I think you're right. They are getting dominated, Jim Nance, getting run over. The offensive line has got to make a stand. Oh, come on, man. You're allowed to break a tackle. You gotta try to avoid this as a quarterback. Don't go off that back foot unless you have to. When you do, there's just no way you're gonna be as good if you had good balance. That time the throws off the mark. Uh, dude, I can't do anything here. 
defense has to be depressed after that play because when you get a chance to get off the field, get a turnover, and get the offense off the field, man, you got to take advantage of situations like that. And a touchback. The Ravens are ready to take over now as their offense heads on to the field. It's Forte in the backfield. First down at the 20. The handoff. To oh, my Forte. God. First down and a whole lot more. Great. Missing tackles every time. That's just the stupid AI nonsense I freaking hate. Teams, how much the running game would be a focus today and for good reason. Here's a running back doing tremendous things out there, as he has all year long. I think that's what's really incredible, and if both teams do exactly what they wanted to do, the offense says we want to run it, the defense says we got to stop it. How about it? The offense, once again, overpowering the defense. The Ravens have had a great rushing attack all game, Phil. Forte's been a consistent force on the ground. Yeah, he's just a running back who never gives up. And when he runs, it's arms, elbows, everything is moving. And he is one tough running back to tackle. Second down and eight. Rodgers still has it. Airtight coverage. Incomplete. That incompletion by the quarterback, hey, I give the quarterback no fault. That was just tremendous coverage by the secondary player. He's in position and able to... Uh, make the football be incomplete. Third and eight. To the sideline. Oh, come on! Good job by the receiver. Holy freaking crap! Can't stop him worth nothing! Let's see how the defense reacts. King's flying out of position in the backfield here. Oh, my God. for space. He'll pick up seven this time. That was a power running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. Moore is going to get set in the slot for this snap. Second down, three to go. They'll go oh, my God. Gigantic hole. Of course. Jim, the defense gives up the first down that time inside the red zone. But there's only so many things the offense can do. Let's see if they can hold them. Halfway through the second quarter. Nowhere to go as this will be a loss of three. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense. And now they have a good situation. Wide receivers are bunched up. Matt Forte right down the freaking middle. And a broken tackle again. How many freaking broken tackles is stupid AI going to get? This is re really retarding, man. That really takes a lot of pressure off the defense. Add the extra point. The kick is good. Great settings. Ravens freaking kick it away. Review these great settings poorly. Your stupid unstoppable AI nonsense. And across the 20 and tackled at the 21. The Jaguars bring their offense back onto the field for their next drive. First down and 10. Out of the eye, it's Lacey. Bishop's there to take him down. Hey, this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time they stopped that run just for a short game. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. Second and eight. Looking to the right side and throwing. Bortles uh. will go for an incompletion this time. Well, the quarterback that time tried to squeeze it into tight coverage, but no can do. The coverage is too good, and the football falls incomplete. Third down and eight. Set up screen. Come on! Are you serious, man? They love it. Uh, is uneasy for whatever reason or just not in rhythm. This is so cheap. This is really freaking cheap. Wilson's gonna look for space now. 
And the tackle is made at the of course, 41. they're going to score again, of course. What else? The Ravens are ready to take over now, and their offense heads Nothing on the Nothing I do field. works. Moore's lined up now as a slot receiver. The Ravens snap it at the 41. Oh, yeah, he runs over. Which safety was that? Yeah, Matt Forte runs over whoever. I don't He thinks he's going to take it for a touchdown. Not this time. It's a big run, but still well done. First down at the 46. Here's the handoff. Of course! Yes! Broken two tackles! Of course, Matt Forte definitely breaks freaking million tackles per game. Yes, he does. The defense is expecting pass all the way. Apparently, Matt Forte owns the safeties of the Seahawks, right? You mix them up, you want the draw play, that's why it was an easy one. Easily all over that offense and brings him down. That last play was a run. Third down coming up. Forte's a running back normally, but this time lined up as a receiver in the slot. From the gun, Rodgers. Of course, again! Oh my god, I'm getting so tired of this stupid nonsense. It was a possibility because this is one of the better passing attacks in the entire NFL. This is retarded. This is what this is. That's how they built this football team. Jim, it's about the quarterback, the wide receivers doing it through the air. And if they want to win games, that's how they have to get it done. Oh my god, man. This is so dumb. Come on. Three more opportunities. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Matt Forte, they up the middle, and that gains one. Easily is the injured player, and we'll take a break. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Second down and nine. They'll run it here, and that'll be a gain of about two. The Ravens call the run play that time down in the red zone. It does not work, but when you're running the football, especially in the red zone, have some patience, stay with it, and if you do, most of the time you will get rewarded. And we've reached the two-minute warning in this one. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. out of the gun has his man he'll be taken down about three yards short of the first defense calls a timeout should be an easy one here and converts on the three well, even though they get the field goal that time, it's still disappointing. You get in that position, you'd like to score a touchdown. And he's tackled right at about the 28-yard line. The Jaguars come to the line, starting this drive at the 28. Nickel formation here for the defense. The Jaguars take it from the 28. And he hauls it in. Lacey takes the hit and is brought down. The Jaguars are down right now, partner, but they have been able to move the football. Bortles had some success, and that needs to continue. Jim, you're right, they're down, but it's not the fault of the quarterback. He is on rhythm, he is hot, and he's put the football right on the money. Gonna try and scramble. Now. I pressed the button, but no! He doesn't get rid of it, he's just gonna take the freaking sack, even though I freaking pressed the button. Of course, yeah. The right guard and right tackle are both full. They get run over and they give up a sack. Portal's gonna take it from the gun. No room to complete oh my that. God. Anytime your receiver running any route, the NFL. <laughs> give me a freaking break, game. Just Don't give me a freaking break. Just throw it right at him. 
Third down on the way with one minute to go in the second quarter. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. That'll put them in what we call plus it's territory. Great. Just freaking great. Situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. No return as this goes for a touchback. The Ravens bring their offense back onto the field for their next drive. Matt Corte lined up in the backfield. Here's the handoff and no running. Brought down at the 29. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt. When you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Offense lines up here. And with that, we'll switch sides and take a breather. We've reached halftime here in Charm City. Back to Baltimore for the second half in just a few moments. Smartly takes the knee in the end zone. The Ravens are set for their next possession. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. A.J. Green with the catch. Green's tackled down at the 29. You need balance in the NFL. That's what it's all about. Why do you want balance? To keep the defense guessing what's coming next. That play call on first down throw. Uh, nice throw and catch, just short of the first down. Kings, a tight end, but lined up in the backfield for this play. And he's tackled, but not until he picked up the first down. When you define yourself as a running team, which this team does, then it's no surprise to see them continue to make plays on the ground, Phil. You can't be good at everything. And this team, their bread and butter, what is it? It's running the football. So they determine before the season, we are going to be a running football Of course, team. another they missed tackle by Earl Thomas. Yes. Another Earl Thomas misses all back. those tackles in real life, game. right? Top 10 in the NFL rushing yards. And he's just adding to those yards. Nice. So run. unrealistic of this freaking game, man. Come on. It's a tight end, but now shifted into the backfield. The Ravens take it from the 38. Eyeing that left side. Bolden taken down. You got to be agile when you make these kind of catches. Running these short drag routes across the field. That time we saw the agility of the receiver. Nice catch. Forte is lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. The Ravens have it at the 39. He's got the catch. Good job by the defense. Uh, they're well taught, well schooled by the defensive coordinator. They know in situations like this, if it's thrown short of the first down marker, they're good. They come up, make the tackle. Now we have fourth down. Touchback and the ball will be spotted at the 20. First down on the way. Cooks is a receiver in the slot. Bortles standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. Oh, come on. Really? He was freaking open. You serious? Hey, the coaches don't care about that. You get an opportunity. They want you to make the catch. Here we go. Portal's going to take the snap from the shotgun. It's intercepted. <laughs> the tackle was made. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. Forte's lined up as the single back. First down at the 27 to the ground and Ayers is able to read that play and make the hit. Good job by the defense 
They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. The Ravens take it from the 33. Here's Ertz. That's an awesome job by the offense picking up this first down here in the second half. They've got a big lead. It's not about scoring anymore. It's just about milking that clock. And that is an art that this team is good at. It. First down here after the completion. Wide receivers are bunched up. The handoff to Matt Forte ends up picking up three yards. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. Nickel formation for the defense here. Tight ends in motion here. Matt Forte gets it here, and he's brought to the ground. If you're going to be in the top 10 in rushing yards for the season, you've got to get big gains. And once again, we see a big gain by this running back who has it all. Third down and seven. Ravens in the end zone. Well, you got a lead. Now you're able to go out there and drive down the field and score a touchdown. This changes how the other team is going to manage the game from here well, on out. NFL Ravens, and CBS defense, sucks. Once again, setting up that score. Horrible Turnover settings, points, of course. Horrible the sliders. The Jaguars are back yes, you can't do anything, the but the AI does anything they want to on you. Six yard line. The Jaguars are getting set for their next possession. Lacey lines up in the backfield. First and ten. He'll fire it out to the left. Good piece of tackling. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Hurry up. Two minute offense. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time underneath but can't find the mark that time as the pass goes incomplete you gotta try to avoid this as a quarterback don't throw off that back foot unless you have to when you do there's just no way you're going to be as good if you had good balance that time the throws off the mark oh come on mark that time as the pass goes incomplete i'm freaking losing my freaking voice here to this dumb crap the defense comes out in the nickel. They're setting up screen. Running room still powering ahead. All you can do is your job. And that was a good job by the offense. Picking up the first down. You're down big in the second half. Hey, don't worry about the score right now. Just find ways to execute plays and get down there and score a touchdown. They get to him just in time. One yard shy of the first down. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Games 16. This next play will be run from inside the 20. And a week ago, they were sensational inside the red zone. First and 10. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. Lacey takes the hit and is brought down. Coming up, second down. Throws to the right. Makes the catch. And Matthews is met after a gain of three. No time to waste. They hurry to the line. First and goal. And that'll close the gap. Touchdown, Jack. Well, it's first and goal. I think a lot of defenses are thinking run here. And so the offense, they call a nice play. Very deceptive. They throw the football and they get the easy touchdown pass. And the kicker's ready to go. That's a touchback. And the ball will be spotted at the 20. The Ravens now bring their offense back onto the field for the next drive. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. Now first and ten. The give picks up about two. 
My man has been a workhorse all season long. He loves to carry the football. The offense keeps giving it to him. Big reason why he's in the top 10 in rushing attempts so far this year. Bolden in the slot. Second down and eight. High Towers, the one who brings him to the ground. Another running attempt by the offense, and there's a reason why this running back is in the top 10 in rushing attempts so far this season. They love to pound the football. Forte is lined up directly behind the quarterback here. He was looking short, but the pass falls incomplete. On third downs, the defense knows in most situations it's going to be a pass, and let's give some credit to the defensive front. They pressure the QB, and they force the incompletion. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. He's got the catch. Casey's tackled down at the 50. That time it was an easy completion for the quarterback on the play action pass. And it fools the defense because look how aggressive the offensive line is. They sold the play to the defense, and the quarterback took advantage. Smith's going to make the tackle. And now they'll try over again on second down. Time for the hurry-up offense. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Brings it in. Breaks free for a gain of about five. What a nice catch by the receiver. Get the pass to yard markers, makes the catch, and gets a first down. Double tight end formation. First down and ten. Screen got the completion. And he's tackled some three yards away from a first down. The Jaguars trail here in the second half. Bortles tried to keep his team in it any way he can. Well, a couple things, Jim. You can't blame the quarterback because they're trailing. He has been outstanding here today. The offense, the offensive line, the play calling, all good. And this pass goes incomplete as he was looking short that time. It's always dangerous when your receiver's running the drag route and you throw it too far in front of him. You most likely are just going to lead him into trouble. Third down and three. On the money. Ward that time in on the tackle. Well, you get a couple first downs on a drive. It just, of course, it makes you feel good about what you're doing. It loosens up the offensive play caller, and there's nothing like dictating to the defense. I love it. The running game has been going in opposite directions for these teams today, Bill, but it's still a tight game. Yeah, Jim, simple on the offensive side. Do whatever you have to do to make it work. If you're running it well, stay with it. On the other side, you got to find ways to deceive the defense. Change up. If you do that, your chances of success, they go way up. Able to make the tackle about two yards shy of the first. One team's running the football, the other is passing, but both are working with their game plans. Yeah, they both are working. As you look down there on the field, one set of running backs are really happy. On the other side, the wide receiver group, they're really happy. So as long as you get it done, that's all that matters. You must be very creative in the red zone when it comes to the passing game. Formations, movement, do whatever it takes to give your players an advantage. That time they get a nice play call, they throw the pass and complete it for a good solid pickup. This has been a long drive so far. Second and goal from the four. And that's a touchdown, and they inch mm -hmm. closer. What a tremendous throw by the quarterback that time for the touchdown. What confidence he has in that arm. Small window, very little room to throw that football in there. He didn't worry about it, fired it, got the touchdown. Ready to swing his leg as aggressively as possible and send the football down to the end zone. Wilson's taking a knee here, so the ball will be spotted at the 20. First down coming up. Matt 
Forte. And this won't even get back to the line. They'll end up losing one. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Keen's usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. Searching for space to the right. Definitely not surprised to see this running back get another long run. My gosh, he's been doing it all year long. So far this year, he's in the top 10 in rushing yards, and looks like he's going to stay there. Aaron Rodgers backed off the line. Shotgun formation. Out of the shotgun formation. Gets it out for the completion. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Good job by the defense. Staying in the right spots. They give up the short pass. They make the tackle. And now we have fourth down coming up. Hester's going to take this one from the 26. And Ward's there to make the tackle. First down here. Watkins is lined up in the slot. Hand off. Tackle made by Peppers that time. This will be second down. Cooks is going to get set in the slot for this snap. Final quarter underway now with this snap. Bishop's there to make the tackle. Well, don't look at the scoreboards, which tells you you're down by a couple scores. Just concentrate on every single play and try to get another first down. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. He has the grab. Got a big lane. When you can't hit the quarterback or put pressure on him, there's not much you're going to get done then. That time, quarterback had time. Throws him down the field for another completion. Lacey lines up in the backfield. Pulls it in. Chandler's brought down after ah, picking man. up only a yard. That leads us to second down. Portals back in shotgun formation. Ah. Forced to the point. What a good scheme that time by the defense. They confuse the offense. They blitz. They don't know who to pick up. And how about the defender? They must love this. Coming in free and gets a good clean shot on the QB and gets a sack. Watkins lined up now as a slot receiver. The Jaguars take it from the 43. Got the nice. Tackle made by Pat that time well anytime you're in the red zone you want to punch it in and get that touchdown if they do that look they still they're still going to be behind but it gives them confidence moving forward Oops. Danielle's got an injury update for us let's go to her now guys I had a chance to speak with a Jaguars oh. team official Crap. at this point the medical staff is going to hold him out of this one with what they're still just calling an upper body injury so guys He's out for the day. Back to you. Portals got it in the gun. Underneath and incomplete that time. When you see this cover two defense as a quarterback, you got to know where to throw the football. That time he did not make a good decision. You got to throw it sometimes deep down the middle. The safeties are not there. They're outside. He did not take advantage of that coverage that time. The Jaguars come to the line, and they put their receivers in a bunch formation. They're down and 10. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Bishop's able to swat the pass away. Well, it's a good thing that linebacker knocked that pass down, because I don't think he could have caught it. So if you can't catch it, knock it down so nobody else can catch it. And the kick is good for three. Then they get the field goal there that time, and it keeps the momentum on their side. It's positive energy. It makes you feel good. Now we'll see if the defense can carry it on. They'll take it at the 20. The Ravens offense now marches onto the field. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. 
First down at the 20. The handoff to Matt Forte. Charging ahead. Brought down just two yards shy of the first down marker. The Jaguars have counted on this defense to keep them in games this year, but so far that unit has been absolutely manhandled. Yeah, this is a game they are not used to. That is for sure. And what you're doing on the defensive side, you get in that huddle and you just want somebody to make a play to turn this game around and get your defense off the field. Taken down at the 33. What a beautiful long run by the running back. Uh, once again, he just proves why he's one of the best in the NFL. He's in the top 10 so far this year. Greens, a receiver in the slot. The Ravens take it from the 33. With two hands, he has it. Butler's in on the tackle. Nice catch by the receiver, but it still doesn't get a first down. The pass play was good for five. Second and five coming up. Two tight ends on the field here. Matt Forte gets it here. They'll mark him at the 41. This offense relies on this running back as, as much as any offense in the NFL. That's the reason why he's in the top 10 of carries so far this season. He's playing out of position in the backfield here. There's the offense picking up another first down on third down. A running back must always know the situation. It's third and short. Don't be looking to break it outside and go for the big run. Get the first down so the offense can stay on the field. Nice job. Aaron Rodgers to be under center. First down at the 46. Finds A.J. Green. And at the 37, he'll be brought down. The Jaguars trail right now, and they just have not been able to rush the quarterback, which is very rare for this defense. Well, they got to find a way to get to the quarterback, and I don't know what do you do. Do you bring in different players? Do you use some different subs? Hey, me, I think they should start blitzing, find a way to hit that QB. Bolden has got the first as he's brought down. Looking at this comparison, Phil, it's fun to see these two quarterbacks going head-to-head -head in a tightly contested game. Yeah, so well played on the offensive side by both teams. The quarterbacks, they've been very sharp. They're on target with the football, and their offensive lines are playing very well. The Ravens take it from the 23. Forte tackled down. Well, the head coach loves to run the football, and that's why this running back is one of the top 10 in the NFL in rushing attempts. They keep giving it to him. He shows his toughness by picking up some yards. Nickel formation here for the defense. Throwing out to his left. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. You're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. About to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. Handoff made. Breaks the long one for the touchdown. Well, in the NFL, no lead is ever safe. So when you got the lead, you push it on in there, score another touchdown, and keep putting the pressure on your opponent. Inside of the uprights. Ravens getting set to kick it away. Hooks is going to test the coverage this time. Just across the 20 and tackled at the 21. They come to the line and it's first down. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. Bortles going to take it from the gun. As Watkins. Nothing like throwing a short pass and watching it turn into a long gain. Good job that time by the quarterback finding the open guy. The defense comes out of the time. First and ten. Setting up screen. He makes the catch. Well, you can't play man to man, Jim, every single play. Every once in a while, you got to throw in the zone. That's what they did this pass play. Hey, it was a good idea. It just didn't work. Bortles standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. He's brought down at 
the 25 yard line. And here we have second down. Portal's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Looking to the right side and throwing. Catch made. Gains 12. Good job getting the first down by the offense. And look at the defensive players on the sideline cheering their teammates on. Keep us on the sideline a little longer. That's what they're hoping for. First and 10. Wow. Nice tackle. That was on Bortles there. I had my receiver. It's just Bortles threw such a bad pass. He keeps going after this offense. And finally, he gets the interception inside uh, their own 20 yard line and stops the offense from getting any points. It's wide open. They bring him to the turf. Nothing like seeing a complete. Uh, even though I somewhat yes, almost came rule, back, I guess. Still here, bull. Their freaking down, offense is still tearing me team. up. And that's still a lot of nonsense. First down following that huge yeah, this. play. And they get to him at the 45. There's nothing like big running plays for an offense. It just makes the offensive lineman feel powerful, gives great confidence to the play caller. There's a reason why this guy's in the top 10 rushing yards so far this season. Forte's hand at the football. That time, that's just a bad decision by the running back. He makes the wrong read. The offensive line blocked it right. But when you make the wrong read, you're going to get tackled. That time, he gets tackled for a loss. Third and five. He sticks to his hands. This offense can't be stopped on third down, no matter the distance. You have to like what this team has done today, passing the football. It's been their identity this season, and that continues here today. Yeah, he's like, listen, this quarterback is a lot like a pitcher. Some days he'll beat you with the fastball, the next day is the breaking ball, and that's what he can do, too. He beats you with power or finesse. It doesn't matter. This play set up by the long gainer. Matt Forte goes to the left. He's going to be tackled right around the 24-yard line. That's a timeout by the team. Play number six coming up on this drive. The Ravens have it at the 24. The give out of the eye. And timeout is called, so we're going to take a quick break and return in just a moment. Now third and four following the run. Moore's in the slot. Rodgers from the shotgun. And he's thrown to the ground. Timeout's called, and we're going to step aside. We'll be back in just a moment. This will be a field goal attempt from 45 yards out. Drives it through for the field goal. That was a good hold, good kick, three points. Good job by the offense. The Jaguars come to the line, starting the drive at the 37. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. He'll take the snap from the gun. Makes the reception. That brings the play to an end. That's a really good throw and catch, and they get the first down. Jim, that's what you want to do. Pick up that first down. Now you give your offense three more opportunities. Nickel formation for the defense here. The Jaguars from the 37. Brings it in along the sideline. Don't see enough of this in the NFL anymore. The out route. Everybody's afraid to throw it. They want all those little safe dink and dunks inside. But that is a nice throw and catch by the quarterback and wide receiver. Almost intercepted. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that in my career where it should have been intercepted and the guy dropped it. You just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on that break? Split backfield here. 
Drop back, shotgun formation. Oh. He's brought to a halt down inside the red zone now, trying to score as quickly as possible. But listen, the defense has got to know the situation here. It's okay to give up a few yards, maybe give up a completion. Just don't give him the big play that gets the quick score. I never even get time to even have my guys run their routes. Uh, they get pretty fired up. But when you sack a quarterback on third down, that is more than happy in emotional defense right now. The Jaguars take it from the 33. And he's intercepted. He's brought down. Well, that game was BS, man. That game was such BS. Screw these sliders, man. I hate it when the AI just freaking scores nonstop. I freaking hate it. It's now second down. Phil, this was a tough loss to handle. Yeah, it was so much time. Screw that, man. Game, thinking you had to yeah, be playing. nonsense, healthy, freaking AI. Nothing can go wrong, and then it does. You make the mistakes and you lose. Tough to take. Look at this. They uh, completed every single freaking pass, pretty much. What complete and utter freaking garbage. Yeah. How many freaking broken tackles did they have this game? Aaron Rodgers even had broken tackles. Such garbage. They don't even say about the quarterback because they shouldn't be beat freaking breaking tackles. Look at this. Eight. And then the receivers had a couple. This was such a bad game, man. Yeah, I'm not sticking with these sliders at all. I don't like when AI can freaking score every single time. No, 